What is up guys, it's Moritz here from Section Store today. We're going to be having a look at this FAQ section right here. It's part of our Glow bundle and for the sake of this video, we're going to be installing it on a separate FAQ page, but I'm going to show you how you can do this as well. So the first thing we're going to be doing is heading on over to the Shopify App Store where we want to be looking for Section Store. After you successfully downloaded the app, you head to the Shopify admin area, where the first thing we're going to be doing is head on over to online store, then let it load up real quick, click on pages. And here we want to add a new page, which we're going to call FAQ. And here we want to assign it to a new template. Right now, it's not going to show FAQ, but I'm going to show you how you can do that in a second. It's going to be done like that. You're going to head on over to the Shopify editor where you want to head on over to pages. And then here you create a new template. And then here you're going to select FAQ. And then the next step, what you can do is actually assign this new page to the new template we just created. And after we've successfully managed that, we're going to click on apps, open up section store where we want to be looking for the section I just showed you. So we type in FAQ. The one you saw earlier is this one right here. It's uh, one of our premium sections. That means it has a lot of customization options and usually the sections are around $9. But yeah, you can see there are many more FAQs here. You can pick whichever one you like, actually. And like said already, this one is a part of a, of a bundle. So if I click on bundles right here, you can see it. You can get the whole Glow bundle, which has a lot more sections for this price. But yeah, let's head on back to that one. Type in FAQ. And like I said already, it's a one-time purchase of $19, no hidden subscription fees or anything. That means if you bought it once, you're going to own it forever. And after successful installation and purchase of the section, you head back to the home area and look for this specific section. I have a few installed already, all the other ones from the Glow Bundle. So we want this one right here. So click on add to theme, and then you can add it to the Dawn Light theme. I've done that already, so it's not showing up. And then you simply want to open up your editor again, where the first thing we're going to be doing here, you can see I have it opened up already, but we want it on a separate page. So if people want to find out more about your product or company, they can simply open up that little FAQ page right here which is empty at the moment to make it look a bit more pretty. We're going to kick things off with a little image banner. It's this one right here. Get rid of all the text. And then we simply throw in a little image. This is, of course, not necessary. I just think it's a nice little touch to have this on top. Perfect. Set and done. And then the next thing we're going to be doing is type in SS. So, FAQ, that's the one we need, pick that one up, and then we can simply click on one of those blocks. How fast do you deliver? We're just going to keep this one. Is the product good? Oh, yeah, it is. And the next one, oh, we're just going to leave that one the same. But here you can see, if you click on it again, it's simply going to generate new ones of those. And that's almost it. But we can do some customizations to the whole thing itself if we click on that block right here. So right now we can see we have the header font size, which I want to I want it to be a bit smaller. We have the the blur of the icon. So that's the background shadow. I can show you in a second how we can influence that. Yeah, 
it's a bit of an extreme example, but I think you get the message. You can even pick it from here. I'd say we choose a soft green because it's going to match the color of the background we're having already. Let's go for that. Kind of that. And the gradient colors. Ah, yeah, that is a mix of those three colors, which you can see right here. So we also want to be sticking for green. Luckily, we already picked three colors. So it's all going to go in that green direction. And that is basically it. Let's see if I missed something, but I'm pretty sure I got everything covered. Another thing we could do is make use of the custom CSS right here. Let's say, for example, you select that headline right here, and then you assign it to one of the colors as well. But we will make a separate video on how you can make use of the custom CSS box in our sections as well. So stay updated for that. And yeah, let's have a look at it, how it's going to look in the live version. Let's save it all up. Have a look at it. So here is going to be our store. And now the next thing we're going to be looking for is FAQ. See if we can find it. We can see the FAQ page right here. Of course, you can add it to the nav bar or wherever you prefer, but this is just for the sake of this video. Let's click on it. Sweet. We have our little banner right here. And we get the rest of the bundle right here. So that is looking nice. The FAQ is working. And that's it. And that's how you can easily build a separate FAQ page with the help of Section Store. Hope you guys found this useful. If there are any questions, always feel free to reach out to me. And if you enjoyed the video, leave a like or a comment. And if you really liked it, you can subscribe to us as well. We almost upload new videos daily to weekly, so it definitely pays off to give a little subscription. Alrighty, have a good one.